Most people would say that this car has a lot of energy because it's moving. But where is the energy here when the car has stopped? Pause the video while you think of an answer. If you chose, it's been used up, you're using the word energy in its everyday meaning. If something has energy, we think of it as being able to do something useful, a sort of fuel value. As this is used, we have to come back for more fuel, or pay for more electricity. So with the car, where is the energy here? Many people would say it's in the petrol, but the petrol needs oxygen from the air to burn. So the energy is stored whilst the petrol and oxygen are kept apart. This chemical store is just one way of storing energy. Here are some more. To be useful, energy has to be transferred using energy carriers. Mechanically, for example, kicking a football. Electrically, for example, when using electricity at home. By heating, for example, when cooking on a stove. Or by radiation, for example, light and microwaves. Let's see how this works. Imagine cooking using a camping gas stove. The energy stored in the butane and oxygen system is transferred by heating to a thermal store in the pan of water. However, some heat is wasted, so this is better. Now imagine using a battery-powered drill. The chemical store of energy is transferred electrically to the motor, which transfers it mechanically by the movement of the drill to a thermal store as the drill and the wall get hot, and a little also is transferred by sound waves, which also heats up the brain and environment as the sound vibrations are absorbed. We can use Sankey diagrams to show that the total amount of energy, measured in joules, is constant in any change, but some always gets wasted. Here is our camping gas stove. Note that the width of the input energy, 100 joules here, is exactly the same of the sum of the output widths here. But for now, remember that in all changes, energy, measured in joules, does not get used up. Energy is conserved. However, energy becomes less and less useful, ending up as an environmental waste heat. So we always have to come back to an energy source for more. Note that we also talk about conserving energy sources, which means simply being careful with them and not to use them too quickly. Find out more about energy resources in this video.